His last foreign tour, a last attempt to sell his message, and a first visit to Greece because, he said, the country needed hope. And hope meant debt relief. He said austerity wasn't working. And on the way to the capital, his motorcade passed the old airport, which is now home to migrants and refugees. The other part of the message of hope was to praise Greece for its role in helping refugees, even in its impoverished state, when so many other European countries had said they weren't interested. Greeks, especially on the islands, have shown extraordinary compassion, and they've rightly earned the admiration of the world. Again, Greeks have done so even as they faced their own great economic hardships. All of which is useful to the Greek government when many Europeans appear to be gradually forgetting the refugee crisis and useful for the Greek government when the country's newspapers describe it as a debt colony that can't persuade the European Union to end austerity and hardship. After seven years, our people cannot take any more austerity. Of course, many Greeks say it's too little too late and Obama should have done this years ago. Still, at least he chose to come here and not Turkey, and that is a consolation to Greeks. By visiting Athens, that he's recognising uh, Greece's role, not just currently, but uh, over, over time, and that there is caution in the White House about what's happening just across the Aegean Sea in, in Turkey. Whether that changes with a Trump presidency, we'll have to wait to see, but it is something of concern here in Athens. On Wednesday, the outgoing president will tour the Parthenon, the ancient home of Athenian democracy. And symbolically, that will be used to suggest that he, Barack Obama, is a man of depth and wisdom who understands history and who appreciates that sometimes societies struggle to do the right thing rather than concentrating narrowly on their own self-interest. Which, without him needing to say it, will leave everyone wondering whether President Trump is at all worried about the stability of the Eurozone or could ever come to Athens and say Europe needs to be nicer to people fleeing war. Lawrence Lee, Al Jazeera, in Athens.